Hello everyone, and thank you for rejoining me here, of course, in Odro Blues, playing as Thrad's beautiful legion. So last time, we kind of took over New Reno, established ourselves as basically rulers of the town, and right now we're waiting to call the savages against, of course, the antelope tribe. Which would be good. We can large-scale slavery, enslave our enemies. Cool. Hordes of the north. Placing a bet. I like this one. I like placing a bet. And then tying loose ends the Yakuza territories. You know, we might as well do that too. Setting up shop. I think that'd be good if we could do that. Ooh, Vault City has just fallen. Even though, you know what? Yakuza territories are probably not weak. We probably should take them out before they get too strong, honestly. Yeah. They probably have 10 to 17 divisions. That's... We actually have more, which is nice. That's actually very nice. We should have pretty much... Absolute superiority over the enemy when we go to war with antelope tribes. Maybe the Yakuza tribes, maybe, maybe not. They are fighting Vault City, which is actually very good for us. And, oh, the Western Brotherhood has declared war on the Apostles, and I suppose I could go over soon comments. Cool. Uh, for example, someone thought I might have used scrap motorcycles when I was playing as the Enclave in a different campaign. I don't think I have that. might have been someone else. I don't think that was me. Um, there's some, potentially a way for us to for us to become New Mariposa uh, with this mod. So that might be possible. Especially if we might end up backstabbing the Troll Warren. Maybe, maybe not. Yes, yes, yes. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I don't know. We'll see what happens. And someone also asks when I'm going to ask when I'm going to play the expert. AI mod for Hoi 4. I, at the time of this recording, I have no idea. I'm extremely busy at the time of this recording, so I, I have no idea. I apologize. I just don't know. Anyways, Happy New Year, my friends. It's January 2277. That's a great new year. That's a great new year. And Because we're going to be expanding. And now we shall grab Wayscent Intuition. The leg infantry recovery, it goes up. Leg infantry actually gets more recon and reinforce rate, which actually doesn't really do much for us. You know what? Hmm. Army... All infantry motorized. All infantry motorized more. Uh, infantry combat width. Ghoul infantry. Ghoul infantry. Um, honestly, going down this path doesn't really look like it gives us that many benefits. But we're still going to go down it. Initially, I'm like, it doesn't look like it's giving us that much. And before we hit 80% where I cannot do this anymore because we have too much stability. We are going to go ahead and grab, what, 100 days, 100 days, 100 days? That's not good. Uh, we're going to grab this one. Maximize as much stability as we can possibly get while we can. Actually, how much planning do we have? We should have max, yeah, max planning. They're completely entrenched. 41% bonus attack. I think that's pretty darn decent. Pretty darn decent. We still only have 20 factors, which really sucks, though. Man, Vault City, you got Vault City back. You got, oh, you just lost it. You lost the courtyard. Not really good, guys. Not really good. I'm thinking I'm going to save up my army XP to, to make sure we can make sure that the super mutant divisions have more than just super mutants in them. Support companies would be nice. Cool. Let's go ahead and tie up some loose ends as well. Let's see on Klamath. It might be better to take Klamath so we can start coring stuff over here because it's part of California, really. And Oregon. Huh. California and Oregon. Hmm. Klamath Agreements. Taking down the den. We get a core on all the stuff, but we would have to take that last little, little piece of territory as well. I don't think we can be able to beat up the Apostles in time as well to do that. We could go to war with Klamath, and then go to war with the Apostles. How fast can we go to war with Klamath once we take out the, this group here? Ooh. I don't know if these guys could hold on for that long here. Yeah, they don't have a lot of manpower. The Western Brotherhood is probably quite a bit stronger, so we're going to focus down here instead, and we shall do... Tying loose ends. So, the Yakuza have been a nuisance for Nurino almost since its inception. Their raiding parties often disrupt dealings, but they have never breached the city's borders. With their bases finally discovered, we should show them what we do to our enemies, yes. Especially if the Yakuza don't have a ton of manpower. Only a few divisions. They might have some samurai divisions. So be it. Whatever. Try playing attackers. I love it. Yes. I think fighters too. Thank you. Uh, do we not? Oh, we don't have any planes yet. No. Oh, we gotta get some of these big boys. Go ahead and put them on one. I definitely want super mutant behemoths and trained dogs, trained mongrels. There's a lot that I want. 
Not just in this game, but in real life too. But that's okay. Let's go ahead and have a good time. Are we going to win the first couple battles here? God, I hope so. Maybe. Oh, maybe not. Ooh, that one's not looking good. We are ten, only 10 combat with. It does look impressive, our army size, but it's... It's okay. Going up, I'm out. Thrad, do you have any upgrades? No, it doesn't look like that so far. Alright, so I was maybe a little overconfident with our soldiers. We're going to make sure we have enough super mutants in our groups first before we do too much. Yeah, 35 versus 103. Not great. Not that great. Go ahead that way, that's fine. How much manpower does Antelope Tribe have? But we do get free cores on this group and a couple more factories, which would be nice. Alright, so we're not doing well at all. Okay, that is... That is extremely unexpected for me, but that's okay. That's okay, we can wait a little bit. Just wait, don't move. At least we got some more army XP, that's kind of nice. Recon companies would be good, very good. Oh, I usually use flamers, that's still a little bit ahead of time. I don't know if companies. They're still attacking me, come on. Good. I'm gonna wait for the division to get out, and... Good. You should be able to win here. This really shouldn't be a problem. Uh, these guys must be 20 combat with. Yeah, they must be. In the meantime, uh, infantry force, goodbye. Super mutants. Yeah. Make yourselves a little bit better. I wish I didn't take all of that infantry equipment off now. That really sucks. That really, really sucks. Yeah, okay, so we can't win here yet. Well, we gotta wait then. Yeah. I thought we'd be stronger than this. Or not. We're very, 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 very incredibly weak. Oh, I wish that I was stronger. Come on. There's no excuse that these guys can't win here. There's no excuse. Even two divisions can't beat up these guys, probably, hopefully. Oh, they're actually attacking us back. Wow. Force the attack. Kill them off. Come on. Kill them off. You're super mutants, for God's sakes. Good, we're winning the battle on defense. We're slowly winning the battle on attack, which is good. Good. Super mutant police. Go and throw this guy on here. Good. That'll help out breakthrough. Ooh, breakthrough's kinda low. Come on. You gotta win. Or you're gonna die. Either one of those two. Uh wait, wait. Let's grab that. Let's grab this one first. That's better. At least we have 55% stability, that's not good. Uh, focus on internal sphere. Now, do we need anything here? No. We could buy slaves. We're going to wait first. Let's buy some guns. Definitely need some guns. No of conscription level, not yet. Tying up loose ends, not bad. And, you know what? Thrad's a new army. Let's do that one. So, the warlord Thrad has conquered New Reno. He now seeks to establish a power base in Nevada and Utah, uniting the desperate super mutant faction so that he might forge a new army capable of punching those who destroyed his beloved master. Yes. That would be very good. How many men have I lost? 200. That's uh, that's completely unacceptable. I swear, that's completely unacceptable at all. Just no. Weapon production, I like that. Ooh. Oh boy. Wait, so you're gonna go to war with me, and go to war with those guys down there too. Huh. That is very interesting. You know what? You're gonna be token defense army. Let's see. I'm gonna keep this interesting. Promote you. You are a bruiser. Cool. Intelligent. He's lucky. I like the luckiness. What, what, what are you doing? Mm. Anything out here? Nope. Uh, cool. You guys come up here. Go and guard against these guys. Yeah. Yakuza territories, you probably just killed yourself off here. So as long as we can defend well enough, we'll be fine. Come on, move. Don't let them come in. Oh, they're going the wrong way, so I feel kind of good about that. Yakuza, like... Seriously? That's a really stupid idea for you guys. But I'm glad you did it so we don't have to take you out later. That'd be nice. Local leader, we'll probably go with local leader. Ooh, life giver right now, but local leader. Oh, we can't do that, we don't have enough. XP. And now these guys are attacking the line like crazy. <laughs> Threats Legion is definitely weaker than I thought. Oh well. Promise of loot. Uh, weekly war support, division organization. I don't really want to hurt my guys yet. Not too much more. 
Hold him here. Come on in. Surround and destroy. Oh, seriously. Oh, come on. You know what? That just means Vault City's gonna win this war over here, which is honestly kind of okay with me, but still. Still. Oh, no you're not. No you're not. No you're not. I've got backup plans for my plans. Actually, I want you to come here. And circle that group. We're gonna not gonna have a lot of manpower for a while. Good. Do not let these people move too. You chose it. Incredibly poorly Yakuza territories. Holy cow. That was a big dumb move by you guys. Bone Dancers, Kimmel Station. Nevada's on fire right now. And I love it. You know what? You guys hold then. Alright, you guys have the attack. That's fine. Alright. Try that on for size. Nope. Oh, crap. Now they actually got us. God dang it. Well, the only chance we have is to escape that way. Oh, actually, escape that way. Come on, break through before that division dies. We did it. We encircled them. We've got it. We've got it. Got to keep it a little more interesting. You guys can retreat for now. You guys help support the attack here. Destroy those two divisions. I've completely ignored Antelope Tribes right now, which is actually kind of pleasant. I'm not going to lie. Ooh, that's not good, though. Good. This was an emergency exchange. You guys go here. You guys stop attacking. We gotta deal with this very soon, because this is not looking good. Come on, kill them off, kill them off, kill them off, kill them off. Uh, do we have any good supplies? Support equipment and fire teams and demo equipment. So, time for a little bit more demo equipment. Do we have enough? Yes, we do. Good. You know what? I never do this. Actually, let's put on recon. We have enough. I don't. I was gonna say I never use fire teams. Do we have enough? We do. Great. Get it to the people. You literally just destroyed two your own two divisions, uh, Yakuza territory. That was a big dumb idea. Uh, we could do that. We're gonna wait though. That was a big dumb idea. Dumbo moment, if I ever saw one. Nope, don't let him in. Do not let him in. Move down here. Biplane fighters, very cool. But at least when we're done with this, we get more manpower. And actually, it's going to raise this up. Thank you. Thread army, get even more non-core manpower. Come on, seriously, kill them off. Kill them off. Kill them off. Kill them off. Come on. Good. They deserve to die. Keep them there. Go straight up for Carson City. You, heading down there, go here, there. You, go here. You know what? You guys look actually really good. Poised to move. Just move in, if you can. Take what, what you can from them. That'd be great. Up them out. I know we're going to lose some equipment. We cut off this capital. This division died. Come on, Carson City has fallen. Hey, an old Tourette's. Hey, look at that. What does that do? Up from the Warlord. Threads Army. What is Master's New Army? Cool. Master's New I don't know what that does. Rebuilding cultural unity. That's, this seems all very nice and fun. I'm not sure what really happens, though. Oh, generic mercenaries. Division training time. More infantry platoons get more soft stack, but I'm not really using... Now, infantry platoons, that doesn't mean infantry battalions. That just means infantry platoons. I doubt that would really affect... Um, super mutant battalions, so this is probably honestly better for us then. Do Pablo's Conquistadors. Anything here worth doing? Monthly population? Modox? Oh yeah, let's do that one. So all, leads, all roads lead to Reno. All roads truly lead... Those looking for a night off of fun Torino, investing in the local infrastructure is sure to lead us into more business and, of course, into profit. This has been a one giant mess so far, hasn't it? Woo! And we like it messy. Come on, take the land, take the land. They don't need it where they're going. Seriously? That's not fair. No, you can't make an enemy VP or a capital your capital. No. No. I'm sorry, but that's just too much. And actually, before we get too far... 
You've done 57% of the war score Vault City, so you're going to get 57%-ish of the winnings. Cool. So I'll give them... I'll take Carson City. They can have the other two provinces. That's that's a pretty much the only way we can really balance it. Which means I'm going to kill Vault City after we kill off the rest of the Antelope Reservation, which would be nice. Very, very nice. I'm right, going to take that from you. Right, at least we got Carson City. And here we will... Give him this. To be nice and fair. Oh, right. Prowling mechanic. Level one. One. Now back to our normally scheduled programming here. Thank you. So now we just got a little bit more luggage victory stuff. More reinforcement, just period. That's good. Uh, the gang. Cool. I doubt that would affect us. We definitely need more uh, manpower, which really sucks. Caravan guards, we don't believe in that wasteland pacification. It's all the way, my friend. Hey, we got enough infantry coming out, which is good. Thank goodness. Go ahead and get on the line. Let's make sure that we're ready to go. Blazing Kim, or Blaze Kim. Reconnaissance. I am using recon companies already. I don't mind local leader, though. I'm giving you more recon. We're going to upgrade it all the way anyway, so might as well maximize it. Cool. So, Antelope Tribes, I've lost 447, you've lost 900. Good luck. What are you doing? Just go over here. Wait, what? What is going on? How much manpower do these guys have left? Oh, zero. Okay, they're done. Pretty much. I'm, well, we have none as well, but that's okay. Just because we're making more. We are absolutely making more. Cool. Three. Let's let our guys get around for us. Get some planning bonuses, attack bonuses. That'll be good. Be smart, be safe about it. Especially if they don't fill out their line. What? Alright, well, just go right ahead. We have no manpower, but neither do they. And with 20 combat with instead of 10 combat with, it's amazing what we can accomplish. It's amazing. You guys. Oh, I gave you more territory that you can't even core yet. Oh. That's not good for you. But that's good for us. Probably. Especially once we can core all the antelope territory for free. For the most part. Nice. Yeah, 20 combat width definitely beats out 10 combat width. Woo! Prowling the mechanic? The maniac, not mechanic. He's not a mechanic, he's a maniac. Give me just more attack. Just maximize it. Good. And Modoc Farmsteads. The farmsteads of Modoc are a great source of food for the people of Reno. Investing in their expansion could lead to a higher population in the city as more people prosper and stay fed. Cool. And also, I do want to let you know, regarding, the, you know, stringy, stirring the giants, we get, we get offer them stuff. I wonder if it's possible. Should we ins do go downs and slaving the Warren or do honorable allies? I wonder if that would be possible if we stir with the giants. We maybe want to make sure that we have good relations with the troll war. What do you think is better? Allying them or destroying them? I think it'd be kind of cool if actually if the super mutants created a faction, our, our faction together. What do you think is better? Tell me, let me know in the comments below. I think it'd be really cool to see them, see us united against the evils of humanity. I'm gonna go this way to cut him off first. Cut, destroy that division. Lightweight metal's nice. Very good. Go ahead and grab that. That's fine. Make down good visors. Uh, I mean, that's okay. Slaver. Non slaver. That's a black. That's not bad. Klepto the Brute? We do lose just a tiny bit more manpower, but eh. Angry APCs. Eh, tanks. Eh. Lots of battalions. I am going to go with outsiders. No outsiders. Hmm. Technically, we should have everyone under us already, so let's not choose that one. Cool. Come on. Come on. 600 losses. Still not too bad. Still not too bad. There we go. Finally. Alright, sorry about that, my friends, but OBS just had to crash. So, regardless, we are doing pretty, pretty okay right now. Over here, we must wait and get them farmsteads done and accomplished before we can core the Antelope Tribe's territory, but it looks like the Bone Dancers 
are doing pretty darn well themselves. Oh, we had 99 guys there. That would have been really nice to have, but oh, whatever. Grab some uh, primitive radio. That would be very nice. Uh, the bow dancers are doing a great job. Oh, and circle month N is going to get swallowed up very soon. Come on. Come on. Swallow, 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 which sounds really weird out of context. Hey, look. They did that too. And another circle month. Bye-bye. Cool. Uh, let's see. Organized slavery. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Outsider volunteers. We would welcome outsider battalions if they were super mutants, right? We probably would. And you know what? We would probably welcome outside uh, battalions if we can slay them later. Hmm. Big thinks right now. Placing a bet, though. The Antelope tribe is now under the sphere of Ro Reno's influence. I almost said realms. And can properly be brought into the fold. Constructing settlements out there is risky, but it is a bet we are willing to take. Yes, absolutely. A good bet. And that's why I did not go to war with the Apostles. Or go to war with Klamath to go to war with the Apostles. Because the Western Brotherhood, well, they just smacked those fellas down. Ooh, Thrad. There goes Camel Station. Good job, guys. Good job. Um, I guess you can get Nerd Rage. That's fine. That is fine, fine, fine. Start stacking up more divisions on the entire army. It doesn't really matter where they're at. But just keep stacking them up, animal friend. We are friends of animals. But, Life Giver. Let's go with Life Giver. We could have done Local Leader. But maybe we will still do that in the end. But I don't know. Ooh, do we need more guns? We currently do not. Nice, we got the gang. The gang's all here, my friends. And let's see. Animal observations? Yes, please. Now, I don't think this is... Yep, this is not affected by infantry buffs. That makes me a bit sad. Oh, well. A little more weight. A little less piercing. I think this will be really worth it. Go ahead and do that. Is she going to throw anything else on here? Doggos would, would be nice, but we're going to go with logistic companies probably. Or anti-tank. Maybe anti-tank. That might be better. That probably would be better. Let's see. Anything else? Oh, help settlements. Nice. We only have 24 factories, which isn't a lot. But that's alright. Demand an end to slavery? Who do they think they are? Do they not realize that we tolerate their existence? We should have put them in chains. I don't think that they are really thinking this one through. Backyard workshops, very good, very good. Uh, go ahead and do that. Refined tools are very nice. Now, we're gonna have... I do wanna core this territory, but we have to wait till we take over all of the Vault City. But we just placed a bet. Good. Next up, what shall we do? Rebuilding Unity. Hmm. Let's try this one. So the cult of Unity is where loyal humans belong. And then maybe we'll go over here. Kneeling in service to the glory of the master. Preaching the good word. Unity may have failed us before, but many speak of bringing it back. I'm not sure if this is good to do it now. Maybe we should do it later. I don't, I really don't know. Oh, and... Do we have any manpower at all? Not really. That doesn't look very good for us. Profits pass me ahead. I love... I love making money this way. Good, we got a little bit of an Air Force too. Very nice. No pilots though, but you know, whatever. Whatever. Give me more political power so we can course up very quickly in Vault City. Oh, and the Troll Warren declaring War of the Bone Dancers. Very nice. And I do will go to war with these guys soonish. 65 days. We'll go to war in 65 days. Very good, very good. In the meantime, let's train. A lot of you guys need. Okay, you know what? Maybe we'll get an alliance with Troll Warren. Maybe we won't. They are going to war with a ton of people. Which is... Questionable in my eyes. But you know what? Once again, in the same video. Happy New Year, my friends. It's 2278. Last year was wild. This year, hopefully, hopefully it'll be even more wild. Yeah, we got that one. Oh, wait. We can... Yep, there it is. I said this earlier in the video, but we can actually form New Mariposa. Hopefully, in the end, if we attack California, get to South Mojave... And, and Washington as well. Huh. If we control every state in the regions of South Mojave, South California, and California in general, we core those states. Otherwise, if we instead control every state in West Washington, no, we core those instead. Oh, you can core either or. Any puppet that is completely in any of these territories will be annexed. Any states with any, any of these territories owned by puppets, any of these states owned, will not completely within any of these territories will be annexed. Any states... Hold on. Any states within any of these territories owned by puppets. Oh, that's cool. So, Anasim. Thrad the Immortal gains the new master. 
plus 30% political power gain. Holy cow. Construction speed, justify war goals time. Oh boy. I think I'm feeling a little aggressive towards the NCR all of a sudden. Hmm. That seems like a good idea. So, many within the army believe that bringing back the cult of unity will increase our odds of survival and give purpose to the hum humies who are too weak or young to survive the transformation into super mutants. The advantages are clear, but those among the younger generation of mutant consider it a waste. They would want this? Bah. Some of the weak survive. Three units of super mutants are created for our army. You know what? I love more manpower, and it could actually honestly use it because we're not making any more right now. Hmm. The master would want this. Oh, the master would really want this. Oh, yeah. Cool. Uh, Steering the Giants. Hmm. I want to say that one. I want to watch the Troll Warren struggle a little bit more. But let's do Modoc Slavers Guild. Though quite a controversial faction, enslaving the people of Modoc would cause an influx of slaves that could be used as bodyguards for mobsters and retain the benefits we get from working their farmsteads. Yes, just a little bit less stability in exchange for other good stuff. And ooh, we actually have one extra. Uh, let's put it there for now. I definitely want to put more planes on here too, eventually. That'd be nice. Troll Warren, they're doing okay-ish. Ish. They might die. They might die in the end. Hmm. Well, it would be quite a shame if they couldn't survive. Get four factories or get claims on their land. Hmm. Enslaving the Warren. Animal observations, good. Army breakthrough. Army recovery rate, good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and increase our manpower if possible. It's only 2% more, but we'll see what happens. Because, oh man, they are... Oh, that's, that's an encirclement. That is, but... Alright, you guys... Oh, we're done training, too. Good! Oh, as soon as that happened, of course. So, these guys, they're not doing so well. I doubt they have that... Yeah, they really like, probably have no manpower. And we can get... Ooh, the capture of Lincoln, nice. And we can get some free cores on Yakuza territory, which I obviously very much love. We need some air bases. Do we? Have, oh, we have some right there. Not bad. But we have no manpower to even use them. So, all right. Not too worried about winning here now. Tar New Canaan, Tar Walkers, very cool. Just go right through there. Oh, and the NCR, a very violent, democratic place. Oof. The promise of loot. Uh, yeah, you know we could probably use that. But ooh, I do want to save some political power up for when we get Vault City. I would love to core Vault City. Improve living standards. Let's do that one. That's fine, too. Refine tools. Good. Good, good, good. We probably don't really need that, honestly. Not yet, at least. Do that one. Good. And monoplane attackers are very nice. Incredibly nice, actually. We're going to do grenades, because apparently I usually choose flamers. I'll probably use flamers in the next campaign. Cool. We need more electricity, too. Ooh, no, 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 no. We need more guns. Yeah. Emphasize guns for now. Hey, we got these guys off. Nice. Anyone have any issues? Any problems? Anything that they want to bring up to the front of the class with? We got more manpower now. I'm loving it. Well, it's not McDonald's manpower, but still manpower. Slavery outlaw would enslave our enemies. Eh, that stuff is okay. Reno Airport, old birds. Oh, even more population. That'd be kind of nice. Damage to garrisons. I did not realize here Army Depot excavation. So. Old Reno Airport. A restoration effort could be made on the airport from pre-war Reno, allowing it to be reused as an airbase just outside of Reno. The possibilities of a network of Reno planes is endless. Nice. So once we have this, that'll be great. Um, fellas, I would recommend movement. Motion is lotion, as some might say. Thread Reno, would you have anything for us? Not really, that's okay. Uh, Blaze Kim, you blazing? Kind of perceptive, too. We just need more experience, that's all. We could use more manpower, period. Uh, and we're going to take Vault City. Beautiful. We have lost 49 versus 849. 51. Okay, not bad, not bad. Come on, guys, keep it up. You're doing great. You're doing a great job. I get some radar. I like radar. Uh, these guys really don't want to move. We definitely got to get some logistic companies, though, next. That is El Nexto. And friend Besto. Let's 
Uh, I love having no manpower. New Vegas declared one of the New Vegas declared one of the damn busters. Is that is that legal? We'll make it legal. Ah, beautiful. The Reno Airport, very nice. Brad's Legion is looking beautiful. You know what? Nevada, Eastern Nevada. I do want to push up north, and it looks like the Troll Warren are really struggling. Hmm. Hmm. I want to get more manpower, but Klamath Agreements, Dead Warriors. We might just take down the Den. How long would that take for us to go to war with these guys? 125. I think it's time we help out those to the north of us who call themselves Super Mutants. I think that'd be quite fitting for us. Oh yeah, we need more fire teams too. Oh, buddy. Keep it on four for now. Damn. What? Damn busters? What the heck? Vegas, you're very aggressive. How did you take that? Usually that's kind of... can't really take that, but okay. Okay. Relax, relax. Cool, man. Well, I'll let you do it, damn busters. Actually, who's Vegas led by? That might... Like, no, I think so, Mr. House, yeah. Okay, whatever. Still mobilizing? Thank God we are. Woo. Still no manpower. Actually, how many are we making? Just two. Let's cut it down by one, and that manpower immediately left us. Guys, we had to do some occupation stuff, which sucks. Cyclops drive is really bad. Vault City is really bad. Well, actually, not too bad yet. Old Reno Airport. Let's take him down the... Oh, we could, but we're going to set up shop first. So the land of the Yakuza occupied is actually valuable, with some quite populated areas. Perhaps now we should franchise and set up casinos in the new territory we have acquired, to bring them, of course, into uh, the fold. Pretty good, pretty good. Yeah, the Warren, they're doing pretty well, but... Oh, oh, that's not good. They're already doing critical population. Ooh, I love Night Stalkers. I love them. Cazador Venom. Oh, I hate Cazadors. Oh. Keep building, guys. You're doing a great job. You know what? This will be the last thing we do in this episode. Come on. I got 65 guys. Never mind. Fragmentation grenades. Cool, cool, cool. I love fragmentation grenades. More recon, though. Not bad. Better dynamite. Better grenades. Better warfare. I think so. This might put us at odds with the with the troll worm though, which is not ideal, but whatever. Go ahead and do that. We can't quite win here, that's okay. Our camel station is the capital now. That's kind of funny. And this, I wanted to go up north. Oh, actually, I want to. Uh, this is still Nevada, which kind of sucks. But whatever. Hey, buddies! Yeah, you want to give us some melee equipment? Yeah, totally, man. Totally. They're attacking us while we're attacking them. We took the capital again. So these, well, we'll take as much as we possibly can. Uh, I'm going to probably, honestly, just take all of North Nevada and give the rest of these guys. Even though that might, that would probably put us at odds with uh, the Troll Warren because they probably don't want us to take their claimed land. This could be really bad for us. What could be really good for us? I don't know. We'll see what happens. I, I really don't know. But hmm. I would like to see if the troll won't get off the Marler tribes too. We've lost 26 guys, not bad. Versus 3,000. We've killed off 1.4 thousand though, so. Actually, we've done more in the war than the troll warren. Wow. Uh, I'd recommend movement. Thank you. Come on, kill these guys off. Nice. Ah, setting up shop. I love cores. And we shall next do Stirring the Giants. The super mutants of Troll Warren under the first are among the greatest forces in all of Northwestern America. They would serve as fine allies. Oh, yeah, go ahead. The Empire of Ashes joined the Northern, Northern League. Empire of Ashes? That sounds amazing. It's just Draco Immortalum. That looks really good. Alright, so, you know what? Dancers, we'll spit you up. You, me, and... Patrol Warren, it's a three-way dance, of course. Uh, I think this is Nevada. If not, we have the parallel peace conferences on to move things around if needed. Cool. That's a good look. I might have to take this. Nope. No, oh, that's good. We actually did it really well. Perfect. And we did do 50%, so. I wonder if I can kill these guys off as fast as possible. I really doubt it, though. 115, we'll go down this way instead. 
cool, but that's pretty much going to end today's episode, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it. It was very messy early on. Much more messy than what I thought would happen. Regardless, I, I enjoyed it, and I hope you did as well. If you did, consider leaving uh, maybe a like, maybe a, a, a subscription or two. I'll check out my Discord link in the description below if you haven't already yet. As you can tell, I'm very tired. Regardless, I hope you all have a great rest of your day.